Don't give me those puppy dog eyes. The answer is still no. 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 Love. I'm sorry. Until the doc signs off, you gotta stay here. Yes, I'm aware of how much you hate being here. You've only mentioned it, oh, 100 times? <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm in such a good mood because you're actually looking like a person again. I'm not being dramatic. Sweetheart, I found you bleeding at the bottom of our stairs. Do you have any idea how terrified I was? You still hadn't opened your eyes by the time the ambulance got to our place. So, yeah, I think being a bit overly cautious is exactly what you need. Especially since you can't even remember how you fell down the stairs in the first place. I hope, for both our sakes, you are slightly more capable than that. Otherwise, we're gonna have to move. No more stairs. Boom. Problem solved. <laughs> I thought it was quite clever, actually. <laughs> Listen. The doctor only has a few more tests to run. She needs to make sure you didn't crack your skull open. Don't give me that. It's not just a bump. You were bleeding. I'm not going to argue with you. Please, love. Just humor me, okay? If the doctor says you're all good, I'll be the first one to get you out the door. But until then, you need to stay here. I know. It's okay. It's just another day. You don't need to apologize. It's fine. Really. We can celebrate my birthday tomorrow. It's not a big deal, I promise. If you really are sorry, then take better care of yourself, okay? No, you don't. You've been skipping meals and working way too hard. Don't act like that's not the case. I know you. I know how you'll just go until you quite literally drop. You can't keep doing this. That would be the best birthday present you could give to me. <laughs> Fine. And that too. But tonight, I'll take you getting a clean bill of health over a new TV. Easy. You shouldn't move around that much. You hit your head. Until the tests come back. <laughs> you should really be ashamed of yourself. <laughs> yeah, you are that obvious. I know you're just trying to distract me. It's not gonna work. I'm immune to your seductive charms. Hey, what is it? Does it hurt? Should I call a nurse? Babe, why, why are you crying? What? No, no, not at all. 
All I wanted for my birthday was to spend time with you. I would have preferred it to be out of a hospital setting. But hey, there's always next year. Long as I'm with you, I'm happy. Shh, love, really. It's fine. We'll redo the whole birthday, okay? Just breathe. I've got you. You don't need to cry. Please stop crying, baby. I hate seeing you like this. If I were mad, I'd tell you. The only thing I'm upset with you about is that you let yourself get to this level. Promise me you won't do this anymore. You need to eat three meals a day and sleep at somewhat of a normal hour. All those late nights working on projects are ruining you, love. Do both of those things and that will be the best birthday present ever. Okay? Good. Then smile. See? That's better. What? Are you sure? Uh, okay. Scoot over. Comfy now? I love you too. Hmm? No, we can get takeout or something. You don't need to cook. I just want you to rest. If you insist, you can bake the cake. But nothing crazy, alright? <laughs> yeah, no Pinterest recipes, please. Maybe just stick to chocolate. Mm -hmm. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> just relax, love. The doctor will be back soon. Until then, let's just watch some TV. It's my birthday. I get to pick. <laughs> you still love me. Alright. Settle in. <laughs>